the opening batters for Sierra Leone are already in the batting crease. And the two umpires for today are from Kenya and Sierra Leone, respectively. David O'Dea. Ladies and gentlemen, well, what a missed opportunity for four runs. It's considered uh, eight runs, but you have one wicket to show for it. Brilliant shot there. A loose one down the fine leg area. Yeah. Well glanced by Aruna for four runs and it is end of that over. Very well played. Good square cut by Aruna to the square leg area. The feeder could not stop that. And one of the ways to restrict any good team from scoring high runs High total is to make sure that the numbers of boundary they score. Oh, is shot! Another sh square Beauty. cut. Beauty! Another square cut, but this time it was played earlier, just before, before. first over and perfect way to start in the batting crease Lansana Lamin first ball four runs off Michael Abuaye's bowling instead of uh, dotting the balls you are right you definitely understand this game so much Jaffa was introduced by Daniel John Bangura walking down to the pavilion. Good shot. One day. Lansana Lamin seems to be in the mood. And once you are shown, Robert Arvid, genuine all under. He can bowl, he can bat, and also feel so much. He's got in that wicket off his first ball. Abbas is out, not knowing. And he's their top performer with uh, 76 runs. We'll continue to keep it up to speed. Four runs. Big shot. Maximum six. Lamin is on fire. And just as I say that, the hit is six. Commentators, of course. <laughs> Absolutely. You know your onions. Lansana Lamin is in the mood. Oh, what a shot. Hits with disdain <laughs> over mid wicket. One bounce, four. That's six. No. Many people may not know, but Obert Avi has one of the highest individual scores on this week on this pitch. Absolutely. Um, I think it was 217, um, not out against the Bejuleki Cricket Club, and that's a wicket. It looks yes. like that's a wicket. That's his. That he, was, he was. He um, was. Still having doubt, and I mean uh, Lansana Lamin, but um, um, heaters, but things have not just um, gone according to plans for him, and um, they will expect him 
to do better. And he hits one in the sky. Long gun is coming in, a catch, and Godfrey takes it. Wicket, but more importantly, another dot ball. Um, Which was 95. Yep. Yep. So you have to take the uh, the positives from you know every situation. So they might come out and say, you know, excellent shot. Maximum. He's got that height. He's and got, just when we were talking levels. about it, they crossed it. Yes, yes, 96 runs. Um, yeah. But and they should give it a fight. Um, I think this score of 120 makes it competitive at the very least. Um, and just as we say that, Bowling will not afford him such a luxury. He tries one, skies it. I think it's gone. Got fed under it, and he missed. He misses it completely. Looks like he was under. He was right under it. And uh, the explanation: we make it three out of four, and for C alone to notch their first victory in this tournament, they need to ensure that they don't get to 111. I've been enjoying commentary batting lineup for Ghana. Great start from Kwasi Awe Awea. They make two runs. Himself and uh, I look forward to it. That's a horrible looking hoik, and he owes out. Samson Kwasi Awe Awe is gone. This is the drama you talked about. Team, one, one, one on the scoreboard. I think it's a small run. And this is commentator's course at its finest. Just after you say that, he hits a boundary. <laughs> <laughs> chance and that's a six. Rexford is starting to get into the game more and more now. Two uh, have held on to their wickets and are getting runs now. And another one swipe to mid wicket. Every time it's short and wide because it's not quite quick Rexford is able to Hits it hard. Six! The hands are up. Maximum representative. Rexford did something different from what he was doing. And he has to go back to the pavilion. He's out. Give Rank, me sweets. Thank you to us. Give me the treatment. Maximum. That was just too sweet. Oh, some good fielding. By Abbas Solomon Bla. Fully expected to end this over. Backward shots there. I mean, going back foot to play it. Not Godfrey. Cuts it into the extra cover space. And they run two. And they win the game. By eight wickets. Resounding victory this time around. Congratulations to the Guardians. They were untroubled. They were unfettered. They didn't really bother the Guardians in the batting crease. And they got that resounding 18 runs in four overs. Michael Abouaye, two wickets for 30 runs in four overs. 
Akil Isra Sied, one weekend for 26 in four overs. And for the Ghanaians, Godfred Bakiwem, 41 runs of 40 balls. Rexford Bakum, 26 runs of 25 balls. Kevin Awala, 23 runs of 24 balls. While for the bowling, George Sese, one wicket, 17 runs considered in three overs. George Edward Ngeba, one wicket, 20 runs in four overs. And for Raymond Coker, no wicket. And Ghana won by eight wickets. See you tomorrow.